Hi, I'm Dave Barton, Director of Education for Enzyme Medica. Welcome to Enzyme Medica's Education Corner. Today's topic is how does natokinase work? Well, uh, of course, we've discussed enzymes in the past, and we've talked, uh, again, we'll reiterate uh, the situation where you have a protein that is forming a complex structure. And uh, these proteins, in essence, part of our body, um, uh, many of them become enzymes and depending on the shape or the structure of the enzyme then determines its ability to function Well in today's topic, how does natokinase work? Natokinase is a specific enzyme with a specific shape and it does something very unique for the body For instance, if um, we injure ourselves or we cut ourselves there are actually dozens of enzymes that go into play almost like a domino effect or a line of factory workers all playing their part to do one thing keep that precious fluid blood inside of you so we cut ourselves here ow we hurt then the domino effect occurs in a very particular order all of these enzyme actions create for us a life-saving blood clot and that seals the wound now out of the tens of thousands of enzymes that work in the body and run the body and help us to stay alive and keep alive at all times, there is only one enzyme in your body that your body makes that will actually dissolve this blood clot, and that's called plasmin. Plasmin is the only proteolytic enzyme of your body that dissolves blood clots. So for instance, when we're children, we're out on the playground, we skin our knees or we stub our toes or we hurt ourselves in some way, a blood clot is going to be formed in response to that injury along with inflammation, a number of other issues that uh, come about, and the one enzyme comes into play, plasmin, to dissolve that blood clot, thus it no longer exists. Well, in our education of enzymes, we find again that as the body is getting older, what happens to our ability to produce enzymes? It begins to go down. And in many cases, because of stress, um, smoking, pollution, uh, the chronic injuries that we face every day, uh, pathogens, uh, bacteria. There's a number of precursors that can induce this response even more often outside of physical injury. So we're more and more prone to blood clotting and less and less prone to dissolving that clot. Thus, nature gives us an edge. Fortunately for us, nature has provided a wonderful enzyme called natokinase. Natokinase has a very similar structure to plasmin. So these enzymes, again, structure determines activity or determines the ability to function. Natokinase has a similar structure to plasmin, and thus natokinase works very, very similar to plasmin. It actually helps to dissolve blood clots. It's breaking down cross-linked fibrin that is created in an inflammatory response or an injury or wherever a blood clot may be created in the body. And nato -K has the highest amount, highest potency of natokinase that we make in any of our formulations. Now with just this simple process in mind that we've discussed, a number of uh, supportive areas can come into play, whether it's cardiovascular health or circulation or anywhere where you're dealing with cross-linked fibrin uh, and blood is flowing, natokinase could potentially work the same way that plasmin does being a support. And really, who doesn't want better circulation to their brain, their heart, their liver, their kidneys? Everyone wants the best circulation they can get. The better circulation that we have, typically, the better uh, off our health and our life is. So how does natokinase work? It's a hydrolase enzyme. It's using a water molecule, like we use a pair of scissors, and basically breaking down amino acids off these protein bonds, dissolving, hydrolyzing, really, that blood clot.